ask that staff proceed with the implementation of a learn, lunch and learn program. Uh, this first program will be held Thursday, August the 11th from 12 until 1 on the second floor of our administrative complex here next door. Um, the purpose of this will be a discussion of general government. As you all recall, it, uh, the lunch and learn program uh, will take various uh, topics um, and allow the public to meet for an hour, ask questions, um, interact uh, on those uh, particular topics. And um, as I said, the first one will begin uh, August the 11th from 12 until 1. And Paige will be uh, conducting that first meeting. Any comments on that, Paige? Yes, sir. Uh, also, Mr. Chairman, um, I would like to, since we are recognizing individuals, I'd like to recognize Mr. James Pope. Uh, James, if you would stand. James uh, has been serving an intern program with us. Uh, he has completed his uh, MPA and uh, has done a very good job for us. He uh, has assisted both planning, engineering, almost every department uh, in one way or the other. And uh, James, I appreciate your efforts and I uh, wish you well. Thank you for the opportunity. Thank you. Uh, and we have received a request for consideration of uh, resurfacing on Snake Nation. Uh, at this point, I do not have, uh, well, I've, I've got some cost estimates, but I'd like to uh, be able to fine-tune that and come back to you with uh, how that would be funded uh, at this point. I don't have that answer. So uh, rather than present it to you tonight, I need to find out where that's going to come from. So um, that's the conclusion of the report, Mr. Chairman. Mr. Chairman. Yeah. Mr. Preacher. Yeah. On the lunch and learn, um, a couple of questions. Uh, how, many, how many folks can be in the room, how many will it accommodate, and how will we determine who those people are for the lunch and learn? Uh, we can accommodate 30 people in the room, and it'll be on a first come, first serve basis. Okay. We, we, can you post that to the website so it, people can sign up from the website? In addition, if we have more than 30 people that are interested, then we'll take the first 30 on Thursday, then we'll pick another date the next week, and we'll do it again to make sure that could you do a larger number at one time if you met in chambers or something? Mm -hmm. Would well, that make it more accommodating? The challenge with that is being able to provide a place for everyone to be able to actually sit and eat while we go through the presentation, number one. Number two, oh, we're afraid if we get the group too large in one seating, that you'll lose the closest to that environment for people asking questions and being able to get to everyone's questions. Okay. The first session is an orientation of the general government. Yes. That's a great idea. Thank you, guys.